Hi, I'm a macro. I'm cooked today. Be gentle to me. So let's get started. The good macro has rounded body from belly to tail, and a beautiful pattern like this. And it has thick body too. First, I take both sides of scales, but there is a few scales like this, so it is easy to take macro's scales. Now I cut off the head. I cut the berry to take guts and head. So I clean the blood with water. So let's go. Now I'm done. I wipe the moisture off a macro carefully. This is beautiful, isn't it? Next, I fillet a macro into three pieces. It is an important point that a macro is so delicate fish, so you can fillet it very carefully. After that. For macro, I put too much salt on it. Otherwise, excess water doesn't come out. That's because macro has a high water content. Now I put in in refrigerator for over one hour. Look at this! Excess water are gone, and also it helps eliminate the strong smell of macro. And I prepare the vinegar water and cold vinegar to clean a macro. Please wash it carefully, otherwise macro tastes very salty. I pickle a macro in cold vinegar evenly for over an hour in refrigerator. Ja ja ja! Are you surprised? This is not. Rotten macro, of course. After that, I put this in freezer for over two days. That because to kill anisakis, which is parasite, they are often in macro, so I recommend that you can do this. First, I take bones like this. Also take these small bones like this. Don't forget to take this side's bone. And I take a skin of mackerel. At last, I cut for sushi. So that's all. Thank you for watching. See you again soon.